Hey guys, Rav here and once again I'm back with a handful of tips for the new 1.08 update. I'm not normally one to ask, but if you do enjoy this type of content, make sure you're subscribed and have the notification bell turned on as YouTube seems to be a bit funny when it comes to pushing out the videos lately. Anyway, without further ado, let's get into our first tip. There is a chance to cut yourself when collecting sticks from bushes using your hands. To prevent this, wear gloves. You can get away with eating raw food as long as you consume some multivitamins moments before. You can combine pristine rags onto damaged rags to make them all pristine. You can actually fish within these water troughs. You can also fish without a worm, but it will be less successful. When moving wheels, carry them within a bag. This will allow you to jog and sometimes sprint. You can lay down on top of a grenade to save your friend's life. When on low blood, lay down and don't move. This should reduce the chances of you falling unconscious. In addition, when laying down, you burn nearly no calories. You can save space by storing a pistol within a holster and then the holster within your inventory. The water dial within a car is the opposite way round to the rest of the dials. This fireplace on the northeast of the airfield can be used just like a normal fireplace. A pickaxe can be used instead of a shovel to construct watchtowers and fences. As well as human meat, the guts and fat from bodies will cause brain disease. A barrel will begin to fill with water if left outside during the rain. Be careful when picking up a new jacket, swapping it with an existing jacket on the floor can sometimes cause it to glitch within the floor, making it unlootable, potentially causing you to lose all the items inside. You can loot items through these tent windows. Currently, the only way to get green and woodland ghillies is from helicopter crash sites. By default, there are three helicopters active on Chernerus and five on Livonia. On Livonia, these outside boxes can spawn loot. Exiting a car while it's moving will cause you to roll. You can do this at any speed and take no damage. Infected will struggle to hear you during heavy rain. Using a water bottle, you can extinguish a fire. Doing this will cause it to become unlightable. If a fire goes out, you can still cook on the embers. Be careful when using a ghillie wrap as it can block your vision over your shoulder. If you don't want anyone else to get the loot, you can bury the bodies. The same can be done to zombie bodies to cover your tracks. Flies will continue to remain at cut up bodies. Use rubber slugs to knock players out. This can be useful when capturing other players. You can conceal a lit chem light in your inventory. This can be particularly useful when exploring during nighttime. Occasionally you can cause a game crash by throwing a flashbang at someone. If you have a weapon in your hands and can't put something on your back, it's because that weapon is blocking you. Right click on the faded image to get rid of this. You can't tie people up during animations. Wearing a vest will increase hotbar slots. When in a melee fight, walk back with your hands up. This will block normal attacks. This technique is also useful for blocking most infected attacks. Rather than loot being assigned to a specific building, it now spawns within a zone, resulting in police, medical and military loot sometimes spawning in unrelated surrounding buildings. Animals can bleed out, so if you don't have a gun, you can always chase one down. You can pour water from containers into other containers. Sneak up uninfected to deal more damage. Infected can be attracted to light as well as sound. When fishing, you have a small chance to catch a cooking pot. You can disarm a bear trap using a long stick or shovel. You can't be tied up while in a bush. Oiling food is hotter than baking it. You can attach a flashlight to the side of a tactical helmet. A wooden crate can be quite hard to place as the crate disrupts your vision. Use free look to negate this. There is a swan hidden in these woods. You can use a universal flashlight in your hands. You can carry pretty much any item while driving, such as a barrel or a gun. Infected are attracted to the impacts of bullets. A weapon on your back makes extra noise. You don't need to hydrate your plants while it's raining. The blast from an explosion can mess up your aim for a slight second. When crouched, you can raise your hands to force your character to stand up. This works in any situation and is useful for boosting. 
you can open a door to interrupt the lock-in animation. Cooking water without food will cause it to burn. A fence kit can be used to stop a car. You always spawn facing north. When raiding, lay down and always look underneath the gate. This can give you crucial intel. A flashbang won't blind someone while driving a car. A grenade has a fuse of roughly 5 seconds. You can cook grenades. Using this method, you could create a trap. There are rooms attached to the side of the Northwest Airfield hangars. This side room attached to these Northwest Airfield hangars are bulletproof. A common glitch is to exploit this shed to get information on the surrounding area. Keeping your gun in a backpack or your clothes will allow you to draw it faster than having it shouldered. A lockpick can be used to uncuff handcuffs. Take off your hoodie and put it within your pants to survive not getting cold in the rain. AI cannot travel through water. When curing a group from the flu, make sure to give everybody vitamins on top of antibiotics. Otherwise, you might give the disease back to one of you before you're all cured. You can now cook on these ovens. Shooting a storage container will destroy it along with explosives and melee. You can loot these wrecks for car parts. You can pull dead bodies out of cars. It takes 5 grenades to destroy a wall. However, you can repair a damaged wall with a hammer and the materials used to make it. The stone oven is immune to the rain and wind effects. The fireplace with a stone circle has a lifetime of 2 days. The stone oven on the other hand has a lifetime of 7 days. You can dismantle wooden crates for nails and planks. You can label a blood bag by taking blood from a player who is aware of their blood type. To light a fireplace indoors, there must be at least 5 meters of headspace. There is an in-game clock within the Olga. You can actually eat dried fruits and vegetables, a lot of people skip over this. A ruined pistol suppressor will still work as a flash hider, so don't take it off. To pick up heavy items, you must drop it out of the container and then move it into your hands first. This includes car wheels. You get mackerel from the sea and carp from lakes. You only need to fill a car radio up to half for it to work properly without smoking. You can kill yourself using a campfire tripod. So that's all the tips I have. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like. If you didn't, a dislike. This will most likely be the last of these tip videos in this format as it's becoming very hard to think of any more tips as I have published over 430 tips to the channel. Anyways, this has been Rab. Stay safe out there. Catch you in the next one.